Howdy. Well, I mean, I'm looking forward to it, obviously. Uh, you know, it, it kind of gives us some, uh, obviously, added depth and stability. Um, you know, I, I'm looking forward to see how he goes all week this week and uh, see where, you know, what kind of reps that's going to get him in the game. But, yeah, I'm definitely ecstatic the fact that he's going to be back and playing for us. Are you confident in his fitness to, to get back after the fall? Yeah, I think, I think his fitness will be fine. He's been working hard in the offseason or during this downtime to, you know, keep his, his conditioning up. It's just a matter of the rust, you know, getting the rust off and getting his technique home back again. But, like I said, being a fourth-year guy, I, 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 I feel pretty confident about where he's going to be. With Ronis being that today, will there be some shuffling uh, on the line Saturday? Could be, yeah, could be. So... I was going to say when you when you look at when you look at the injuries that have happened on the offensive line, how important is that sort of next man up type philosophy for this team? Well, it's crucial, and again, we we kind of prepare for that all year long from spring ball on, and you know, making sure guys know multiple positions. And you know, I've been down this road before, um, maybe not to quite quite to this extent, but I've uh, been down this road before. So, I mean, kids knowing how to play multiple positions, uh, you know, you, you do that, you cross train them exactly for these circumstances. Any update on Day to day. Just check. <laughs> that it? All right, guys. Thank Thanks. You.